Oh yes, sir. Oh yes. Yes, sir. Yeah. Yo, what's good with y'all boys? We're gonna be doing the DreamCon vlog. We about to be vlogging the whole time at DreamCon. Right now, I'm currently at home. I know you see the cut. Fresh, I don't know what fresh to death. <laughs> so yeah, we're really about to be uh, going to DreamCon for the first time for my 18th birthday. So we gonna see how this go. Yo, we're about to head to the airport. Let's go. Finally, after all this time, we have made it. Well, not made it, but yeah, we are now in Austin. Austin. And next, we're gonna head to the hotel and head to pre-registration. I will see you guys then. Okay, wait, look, I know this looks bad. I did not record a lot for pre-registration at all. <laughs> Forgive me, forgive me, please. But it was my first time vlogging. But I did, in fact, meet Rhyme Style. And I did get my badge. For the next Go day. badge. This was a see, I think that's so leap. Your booze. Okay. Next day, I got it covered, though. Next day, I got it covered. We woke up, y'all. It's part two for Dream Cut. I promise y'all I'm going to record more this time. I promise y'all I'm going to record more this time. Today is where the day really starts. Registration was yesterday. There was nothing really going on yesterday. It was just pre registration. Just people talking. Now, y'all see me looking fresh. I gotta brush my beard real quick. All right, y'all. I'm gonna see y'all when I get there. For real this time, I know I lied last time. So anxiety don't get me. I'm alone, bruh. I'm trying to talk to everybody. Hopefully I see Rage. Hopefully I see Real Easy. Hopefully I see Dante. I see Dante. Anna. All right, y'all. I'm gonna see y'all when I get there. Now look, I got this footage from somebody else. But to get right, inside, let's go. Might as well do something two hours. It's hot. It's we either gonna, we gonna stand in line for two hours or oh no, it should keep going. Luckily for your boy, I saw that <laughs> shit. It's crazy. It's crazy. It's crazy. That shit go around the whole block. If we go back to the front. So this was the exhibit hall where you were able to buy everything. They had swords, clothes. Good smell and stuff to put on your body from the rest of here. Just everything. Really, really nice. Now for myself, I tend to buy them. It's recording, it's recording. Oh, yes, sir. Oh, yes. Yes, sir. Anime Gear Guru. Anime Gear Guru, bro. Yeah, there you go. You know Looking what fresh. It is, bro. Come check my boy out, bro. Come check my boy. I got the love. Got the boys over there playing Budokai. So this is the gaming hall where they show all their little games and they're able to play all the games and they host their tournaments. This is also where the first event starts and I'll be some important people, so make sure you stay. Okay, 
you see them boys, but Leezy, Vader, and Halo City. So now they're coming to the area we are. So They were playing or right? <laughs> like trying to get ready to prepare, but I saw <laughs> some of <laughs> <side. laughs> Now, I didn't record my run-ins with them, but it was really fun meeting every single one of them. I got to talk to Agent, Rage, and TK. As you can see, DreamCon got packed really, really fast. Especially for those lines that a lot of those people got in now. And the people are finding the swords or whatever. It was just so funny. Alright, this next event I'm about to show y'all is the basketball game. This game was so hard to get into, but it was so worth it. So worth it. All right, let's go. Shooting around and dunking and stuff, and just flash and stuff to do some warm up. But now it was time for the real deal. The real game is about to go on.
that's how Team Mark won the game over Team Gideon. But now it's time for real hell to break loose, bro. <laughs> So y'all could probably see why I didn't record much there, but I did get pictures with Kai, Duke, Phantom, and Super Duke Kyle. If you know, you know. But yeah, it was really proud that I ended up going home after this. I did really enjoy my experience with this though. I got to meet Kai and all that. So thank you, DreamCon. Finally back. So that was the end of day two at DreamCon. My final day at DreamCon. We back out here waiting for the Uber. Whew. Today's supposed to be good. I think they got rid of wait list, so I gotta be there pretty pretty much earlier than usual. I know you still see the cut. I know it's getting a little raggedy. But you know, we doing good. We got a little, you know what I'm saying? So in this area right here, it's supposed to be the Family Feud event uh, that was sponsored by Konami which was RDC versus AMP. So here we go. And of course it was hosted by Bird.
So that was the end of Family Feud, and I went on to some bros meet and greet. A lot of controversy happened with this event with lines, but I was one of the lucky few who managed to get in. Due to the sheer amount of luck I had, I managed to somehow find a knowing TV near the dodgeball event, and something really special happens later. Now look, at this point I met a special guy named Marky, and he helped me get through this door everybody was crowding and kind of sanctioned me in to get the industry seats. So this here was dodgeball. First it was the girls that went, and then it was the boys that won. This was the part when they made a new thing, the creators versus the fans. And whoever won would go against RDC for the finals. And that's pretty much the end of my adventure to DreamCon. I know I didn't record and get as much stuff with content creators as I liked, but lines were really long to get into places. But now it's time to go home finally. I had a very fun time. I met a lot of awesome people as well as the content creators. And I'm truly thankful for this experience.